what I got going on in the crock pot today. We've got the chicken, onions, lemon pepper, and Miss Dash. That's all I've seasoned it with. I've got it on high. I've got some potatoes boiling that's going to go over in the chicken later on. And I'll keep y'all updated. Guys, our potatoes are done. I've strained them. I've washed them. Now we're going to come over here with a little bit of garlic powder. Sprinkle some of that on there. Then you're going to come with the oregano leaves. Make it look real pretty. I'm going to swish it around and make sure all of them have some. Now, I'm going to put these in the fridge for about 30 minutes, let them cool off before I add them into the crock pot. That I want to show y'all, you see the juice that the chicken makes? It makes its own broth, but you see how the chicken done went from pink to white? That's what you want. It's, by the way, it's been cooking now for an hour and 45 minutes, so I'm going to let it cook. For another hour and then I want to tell you something about this anytime you're using canned goods you always want to wash your top put it underneath the sink run some water on it wash it before you open it and I usually drain the water off the vegetables that's in the can and use my own bottled water but because my chicken already has its own broth I don't need any water at all but I'll show y'all in a sec when I um, add the potatoes and the green beans in there and everything else. I still got the potatoes in the refrigerator on cool. So I've already added the green beans. Then I'm going to go in here and add some egg noodles that I've already rinsed off. I'm going to mix that around. Get it in the juice. I've already shredded the chicken too. Now, remember my potatoes that I had in the refrigerator? I seasoned them with garlic powder and oregano leaves. We're going to dump them in there. Then, I cut up some cheese. Shake that around in there. <clears throat> and then we're going to put the top back on for 10 more minutes. Back with an update. It took me exactly 3 hours and 30 minutes to cook this. So you all would know. <laughs> 